Okay, so I'm trying to figure out what the best way to film this one is. And I've come up with this solution. This is a Chubb battleship. Here is its key. Watch the shackle down here. There it is. So we lock that back up. I've got two drill holes here in this one. And um, we are going to cover that up. With a bit of tape. To ensure that we can't get a look in there. We're going to use my tension tool that I've made up out of a key blank. Okay, it's actually difficult to get up in here while it's <laughs> while it's clamped. I'll just take that out for a second. Get my pick wire in there while we're at it. So this is the best way, really, to clamp it without getting the tool in the way everywhere. So let's see how we do. The other one which I... <laughs> uh, I think I've gotten a bit too used to the binding order of this one. <laughs> Let's see if we can do that again. Um, the other one which I picked uh, was the one that I used for my bike, so I don't want to damage that. Whereas this one is an older one. Feel it click, click. Each time the tension wrench is moving, some binders at the front. Yeah, I think I just had a fluke on that first time. to anti-pick there this time. And there it goes again. Okay. Chub Battleship. Uh, what's that? That's open. We'll just close it back up again. I didn't turn it all the way, so... Okay. Can't really see in there. It's not so great. I've not got any light to shine down. Let's try and move around a little bit. It's a bit better. It's a bit gunky up in there, but I've WD'd it out like mad. You see all its levers are in there. And that's it. Don't know why. I didn't drill this out. Somebody else had drilled this out to, uh, I don't know why, really, try and make a key. I guess they were going to filler it back over. But anyway, good practicing aid. Cheers.